What did Jesus say about bread? Bible Nugents. Jesus spoke about bread in various contexts, highlighting both its physical and spiritual significance. Below are some relevant verses from the New Testament. 1. Physical Bread. Matthew 4 4, but he answered, It is written, Man shall not live by bread alone, but by every word that comes from the mouth of God. Matthew 6 11. Give us this day our daily bread. 2. Bread of Life, Spiritual Bread. John 6 35, Jesus said to them, I am the bread of life, whoever comes to me shall not hunger, and whoever believes in me shall never thirst. John 6 colon 51 svblsux nefeci bread that came down from heaven. If anyone eats of this bread, he will live forever, and the bread that I will give for the life of the world is my flesh. 3. Combining both physical and spiritual aspects. Matthew 26 26, Now as they were eating, Jesus took bread, and after blessing it broke it and gave it to the disciples, and said, Take, eat, this is my body. Luke 22 19, And he took bread, and when he had given thanks, he broke it and gave it to them, saying, This is my body, which is given for you. Do this in remembrance of me. 3 Takeaways 1. Dependence on God for sustenance. Jesus emphasizes our reliance on God not only for physical sustenance, as seen in the Lord's Prayer, Matthew 6 11, and his temptation in the wilderness, Matthew 4 4, but also for our spiritual nourishment. This teaches us to seek God daily for our needs and to recognize Him as the source of all provision. 2. Jesus as the source of spiritual life. Through the metaphor of the bread of life, Jesus reveals that He is essential for spiritual life and salvation. John 6 35, 51. Just as bread sustains physical life, faith in Christ sustains spiritual life. This points to the importance of a personal relationship with Jesus for eternal life and fulfillment. 3. Communion as a reminder of Christ's sacrifice, the breaking of bread during the Last Supper, Matthew 26 26, Luke 22 19, symbolizes Jesus' body, given for us. This act of communion is a directive for believers to regularly remember and proclaim the Lord's death and resurrection until He comes again. It underscores the significance of Jesus' sacrifice and the community of believers as one body in Christ. These insights encourage believers to reflect on both their physical needs and, more importantly, their spiritual nourishment found in Christ, reminding us of the central role of Jesus' sacrifice and the importance of communion in the Christian faith. Greg Gaines Father, Grandfather, Minister, Missionary, Deacon, Elder, Author, Digital Missionary, Foster Parents, Welcome to our family https colon slash slash jesusleadershiptraining.com slash about a slash.